the wall from that corner. Yeah, Harvick really good down in one and two. He can get his car turned and back in the gap. This is where Edwards is a little bit better. Though. Been the best in the middle of three and four. Better get it one more time. Got one more shot. Final lap of the race. The lap car is Marcus Ambrose. And he gets his back bumper down into turn three. Are we going to see the bump and run? Final corner. up here. And that's going to have to really guard. A wiggle, a wobble. Uh, here comes Ambrose hard in there. the throttle. A little bump there, a little nudge. Got to know Kyle Busch is going to be close clear, here clear, too. Clear. I'll tell you what, Ambrose better get down in this corner good or Brad's going to be all over him. Maybe a little bump right here from Brad. Kyle Busch coming hard. Oh, oh, he's still sideways. White flag. No mistake, bring it One lap to go. Double Next lap ends the race. Do they have enough fuel to come back around and finish it? Kyle Busch looking to get back around Keselowski. Ambrose is your winner. And Tony Stewart is up against the guardrail. Wow. What a Congratulations, sir. Ambrose, you are officially a winner. NASCAR next Dell Cup Series. Good job. Junior, Denny Hamlin, Brad Keselowski, Harvick, Burton, Bush, Edwards, Stewart, Reagan, Green Flag, two to go. Boy, Dale Earnhardt Four Jr. Cars. got a great restart. He's out of gas, and there they go. And Burton goes around. 
lot Talking of smoke. They had a little bit of a rag back there, no caution. Keselowski got bounced around, but we are still green. Let's cars, see. Cars all over the place down here in turns one and two. Not real sure how this is going to work out. Still no caution, though. We'll be coming to the white flag, Mike. Dale Earnhardt Jr. out front. Can he make it? White flag. Next flag ends the race. Hamlin trying to close. Track's clear. We're good to go. Seven back. Seven back. Harvick third. Reagan fourth. Logano fifth. What a topsy-turvy finish to the Coca-Cola 600. And Dale Jr. is scooting away. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's slowing, isn't he? 150,000 people on their feet. Jr. Earnhardt. is slowing. He's out of fuel. And as at Indy, the leader at turn four does not get to the flag. Harvick, Harvick, the closer, wins it. Once again, where did he come from? <laughs> Golly gee. Have you ever? No, I am. Once again, never. Are you kidding me? Might be too far back to make it up in uh, three laps. I can remember a race here in Martinsville when two of the sport's best went into turn three on the last lap, tangled and took each other out, and the guy in third won the race. Yeah, don't count out Kevin Harvick there in fourth either. Three to go. Oh, Junior. Nudged around. He and Lugano tangled. Kazowski goes around. Around here. No caution. Keep rolling. Come on. No caution. Need to roll here. And Stewart trying to get around Jimmy Johnson. He's got him cleared off four. To the lead. Tony Stewart, two laps to go. Do they get to the white flag without another yellow? Can Johnson get the Stewart's back bumper? Here they come. Joey Logano into the wall. Far in the wall. Hard. Turn three. White flag's out, though. Lugano still driving around. We are on the last lap. Stewart, Johnson, Gordon. Will there be a bump and run? He's going to try it. Johnson gets there, but not enough. Tony Stewart wins at Martinsville. Flint Boyer spinning around in the final quarter. First race of the championship ran out of gas while leading coming to the white flag he's coming to the white flag this time leading with fuel mileage in play 1.4 seconds back to Kevin Harvick a lap and a half to go and that team never recovered from running out of fuel leading that race either really affected the rest of their chase does he have enough today is somebody going to run out and lose a chunk of points? Will the lead change hands in the final lap, or can Stewart begin his championship with a breakthrough win? Like there are that. cars on the apron running out of fuel as Stewart takes the white flag. It was Kyle Busch, Andy referenced a second ago, on the apron out of fuel. Half a lap to go. Now Gordon's out of fuel. All clear. Keep coming. You'll see Gordon there. Matt Kenseth, Jimmy Johnson, all slowing out of gas. Tony Stewart, the fuel holds up. Tony Stewart opens the chase for the NASCAR Sprint Cup with his first win of the season. There yeah, are cars the running out of gas everywhere around this racetrack. Matt Kenseth getting pushed by the 38 car. He doesn't want that on the last lap of this race. Well, he got pushed all the way down the back straightaway and all the way through three and four. Well, that is illegal on the last lap. Officials will look at it. Look at the guys running out of gas. Jimmy Johnson was out. Kyle Busch was out. Bob Menard's out. Trevor Bain is slow on the apron. Good job, guys. Proud of you. Allmendinger ran out of gas. Looks like Ryan Newman ran out of gas. Jeff Gordon ran out of gas. Look at them all. They got, they got across the start finish line and just hooked the left. Stewart to the bottom, three wide for the race lead. Three wide here, bottom, still three wide. Maybe four as the 99 comes down the back straightaway here.
Russian Kislowski not giving in. Stewart by Bush. Here's Edwards trying to keep pace. Oh, that's close. Look at Stewart drive that far and wow. Stewart by Kislowski to the lead. That's four fresh tires working right there. Edwards racing the two for second and trying to keep up. Oh, here comes Edwards. Got to run. Looking for second place. Look at the hands inside that 99 car. Fighting for control into the corner. All clear. Go get the 14. Final lap. Stewart and Edwards, first and second. Winner takes the championship. This is just the most incredible run I've ever seen out of a race car driver what Tony Stewart has done in this case and tonight. Yeah, I think it's the best driving I've ever seen, and, and Carl Edwards did an incredible job, too. But this is the man right here, Tony Stewart. 2002, he was the champion. 2005, he was the champion. Those driving for someone else. This time, he's an older driver, and he's going to become a three-time NASCAR Sprint Cup champion. Tony Stewart wins it. So we got it. Here they come. For the final couple of laps at Talladega, green flag is in the air. See how quickly 31 and 33 get hooked up at that line. Tony Stewart and Paul Menard not quite together in that outside lane. Look at Gordon and Trevor Payne. Jeff Gordon was on the gas, ready to go. Matt Kenseth has been separated from David Reagan. each other hello and look at jimmy down all the way down on the apron can't get alongside kyle bush yes he can this johnson off the corner you know who's going to win this race that 29, 29 car. Is six behind you outside 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 as outside. they run side by side harvick is there he makes it a three car battle he's gonna he's, he's there and here goes jimmy to the lead he's going to clear kyle off the two they're going to get side by side going down the back again, and that's going to open the door for the 33. Harvick is coming. He, he got, got in the his, wall. No, he got in the corner way, way, way too hard. And Harvick takes second. This is not over. Here he comes. That 33 car is on it, boys. A lap and a half to go. 29 car, sorry. Here comes Kyle Busch fighting it back on the bottom. He's even with Harvick, even for second. 
They're all they're searching for grip right now. And drops back in line. White flag for Jimmy Johnson. One lap to go. Harv's going to have to make a big move right down here. Harvick trying the outside as Johnson. He's got the, the middle momentum. Of the He's got the momentum right there. That's been his strong point. That speed will carry all the way down the back straightaway. A bump. He's going he's to push him up into the corner faster than he wants to go, I think. Kyle Busch is five car lengths back. It's here he comes. Race, and here he's comes got Harvick. him. He's got him. He's got loose. He's got him. That little push getting into three. That little bump. Harvick Johnson switches lanes. Johnson can't get there. Harvick. It's going to be tight. Two laps to go. Remember, seven of the last 11 Talladega races decided by a last lap pass. Boyer and Harvick coming again on the high side. Yeah, Boyer got, he got real tight on the, the side of the 16 car, but it's paying off. Drag race down the back right there. But they can't clear the Fords and protect the bottom because Edwards comes storming back on the inside. Well, what else it does is opens the door for these two cats right here who have timed it out pretty darn good coming to the white flag. And there comes their teammates as well. Johnson and Earnhardt Jr. White flag this time. Those have been the two best cars right there. Most of this race. They're the, just now showing it. The bell lap and the man who started up front leads it. Jeff Gordon. But here comes the next two pair. That These two cats right here, they may have timed it out too. Let's see what happens down the back. Now they will get a draft off Mark Martin. And here's the slingshot to the outside. Stay together. That's what they're saying. Stay together. Push, push, push. Going to get tight down here in turn three. Don't forget Jimmy Johnson and Dale Jr., fifth and sixth. They are there. Which group will they go with? And will it help the Jones cars? Or will it help Jeff Gordon to victory lane? All bets are off. They get to the middle of the travel. Watch out down low. Way Good down run. comes Johnson. Good run. He's you. got room. They're three wide. Three by three uh, to the line. Johnson. Maybe Jimmy Johnson. I believe he got him by an inch. Two one thousandths of a second he beat boy. Okay, a sixteenth of an inch. Have you ever? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. No, we have <laughs> never, never, never seen buddy. anything like that. No. No. What a finish. That's how you shoot teammates, man. Go up and congratulate them. Both y'all won that race. Both y'all.